Hey everybody, Ananias here, and welcome. I'm um, going to continue our NFL type series sort of thing going on because of the, uh, the NFL draft. And welcome to uh, John Madden Duo CD Football, obviously for the Turbo Duo, TurboGrafx CD uh, type deal here. Came out in 93, so it was, uh, I assume this would have been the, for I guess on the Super Nintendo and uh, Sega Genesis, this would have been the um, uh, Madden 94. Um, you're going to see some things right here that I, I don't think was on any other Madden game, and, and I don't know <laughs> why it's on this one, but, but it is. Um, I don't think this particular version was released any other way than this. Um, but, uh, so, so we're going to kind of delve into this here. Um, it's a really, really cool thing to have. Now this, this, I was having problems. Okay, first off, this is the first video I've done where um, I'm actually using real hardware as opposed to um, emulating. Um, I didn't have it on my emulator setup, but but obviously I, I own the game. Um, I got this one for Christmas, 93. Um, super, super excited when it came out. It does seem to be having some problems here, though, that it shouldn't have been having. So I, I don't know if there's a fingerprint on the disc or, or what, but... Um, but anyway, let's, uh, let's move right along. I was having an issue with the television that I normally use, which is a, a Vizio. Um, it's like a, I don't know, like a 32 inch or something. Um, I like using it because it's, or, well, I, I thought it was going to be a little more universal because it has a VGA in, which I, I had been planning on using for, uh, with my Dreamcast. But I'm afraid going through the Elgato, the game capture device, it's not going to recognize it and be able to convert it to HDMI, which is the problem I had here. So I had to grab one of my other much smaller televisions, <laughs> which is what I'm playing on now. And it didn't, it's not having any problems whatsoever, so I may have to get rid of that, um, uh, that Vizio. But anyway, so this is um, obviously was put out by EA. Um, well, actually, you know what, now that I'm... Yeah, okay, there it says Electronic Arts. Okay, cool. Uh, but anyway, this is prior to the NFL licensing, so you're just going to see um, city names, and the colors are more or less going to be going to be correct. Um, let's see. So, and, and then there's no names of players. It's just going to be their jersey numbers. Um, let's see. I, I, let's see who. Well, I got I got to be Pittsburgh. I don't remember who they had in '93. Was that like Barry Foster or something? Um, I'm going to play, okay, let's do Pittsburgh, Cleveland, open turf, fair, and I think regular season, playoffs and all-time greats, without the names it made it really tough um, playing this, oh gosh, I remember this screen, very cool, very cool, but uh, <clears throat> With the controller only having two main buttons, um, they were forced to use the run button, which for most consoles, that's start. So literally, like when you're throwing the ball, you have to press start to throw to one <laughs> of the receivers. Um, but just a lot of lot of fun. So let's, let's, gosh, I hadn't seen this in so long. Now, I think this was the year before they changed the graphics um, to... Um, um, kind of the newer Madden animations, which just looked really weird. Now, again, these are full motion video shots that I, I don't think were ever anywhere else um, in any other consoles. Um, some of them like that, it really doesn't look bad. I, I think it looks really, really good, actually. Uh, I'm going to kick first. Um, others look really, really bad. Like they went out and got high schoolers to, to do the to do the uh, celebration dances and stuff like that because, you know, again, they, they didn't have the license, obviously, so. All right, let's see if I can remember how to do this. And it really doesn't look that bad, I don't think. Of course, I'm not sure how the the game capture is going to gonna handle it because, um, like I said, th this is the first one I've done on actual hardware. So I'm, I'm hoping it'll look okay. All right, let's see here. Three, four. All right, let's try that. So, 
Let's see. I, I think I mentioned in my the previous video. What do you guys think of the draft so far? I know Jacksonville really uh, <laughs> got a got a uh, kind of a a shot to their offense there, um, shot in a good way um, with what's supposed to be a pretty epic quarterback. Uh, we'll see how that pans out, but uh, also a pretty good running back, all things considered. I can't remember what these buttons do. I'm just <laughs> hitting things. You know, and I remember. Okay, so here's here's one of those those weird uh, memories, or, or not weird memories, but just a, a, a memory from my childhood. Um, I remember watching some of these games uh, um, in, in real life, you know, actual you know football games. And I would write down. I would take like for example the Pittsburgh Steelers here, and I would write down um, all the numbers, the the player numbers here, and then watch a uh, a uh, a real life game, and then write the the name of the player, like you would show up on their on their jersey or above their uh, above their jersey there on the back, so that way I would know who, what players were what, or who rather. That wasn't bad, little Rod Woodson. Um, and I don't think there's any way to look up the, the stats on any of these players. Um, but anyway, I, I just remember watching. And, of course, I, you know, I had these huge aspirations of, you know, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get all the players and all the from all the teams and this and that. And, you know, obviously none of that happened. Yeah, that's going to be Barry Foster, number 29. Um, of course, that didn't happen. I, I think, you know, I probably got, you know, most of, of Pittsburgh, I'm sure, and, and maybe Dallas and... You know, a couple other, a couple other things. Of course, you couldn't watch whatever games you wanted to, so it's not like I, you know, it was really easy to, to pull up, you know, I don't know the Rams or something, and, and figure out, you know, who those. Wow, that was awesome. We'll get, we'll get a cutscene here, I'm sure. See, that's cool. Like, I mean, that looks, that's straight up. That's a little, I don't know. <laughs> that's a little less I don't know but it's it's got that charm you know that, uh, that I'm totally cool with uh, but anyways it, it's not like I said it's not like you could just you know pull up and say oh hey you know I'd, I'd like to um, I, I'd like to see you know the, the players of the Rams or the you know the Cardinals or whatever and again and I, I keep saying this but this was you know pre-internet yeah you, you couldn't just look that crap up and so um, you know my, my plans there really went downhill pretty 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 quick so I managed to get you know a few teams but um, it just didn't work out the way that I had envisioned gosh there's just so many so many and there's got to be a way to flip this nope that's not it um, well there actually might not be okay up does that yeah there may not be a way to flip it in, in this uh, there's just not enough buttons get out of my way yay Gosh, okay, this is actually still a lot of fun. Um, I'd be curious to go back now, and because I probably have Madden '94 on the on the Super Nintendo. That's the those are the cutscenes that really don't hold up, um, and I don't even think that was the full scene. I, again, I, I think there's like a fingerprint or something on the disc, maybe, because this is the the disc that I actually got for Christmas back in '93. Um, this isn't one that I, I lost and had to re repurchase or anything like that. Oh wow, look at that crowd! It's <laughs> good. So very cool. And I mentioned in the in the previous video whenever I was and, and I hate to even I hate to even bring this up, but um, I mentioned in the previous video that uh, I, I thought that. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to apologize to anybody watching if anybody was offended. I certainly didn't mean anything by it, but uh, where I said that uh, some of the actors, you know, were, um, it's just something I noticed when I was little that, you know, just kind of, you know, reminded me that the game wasn't, wasn't, was made overseas or whatever, you know, no big deal. Um, these refs do not, <laughs> you can't tell where these refs are from. I don't know why in the world I thought. <laughs> <laughs> I thought they looked <laughs> they looked Japanese, which again is totally, totally cool, but I don't know where I got that from. Like I, I don't know if it was something that we had joked around about when when we were like growing up or or what, but 
you know, because we were constantly ribbing on stuff and this and that, and with the, you know, the, um, the, <laughs> with the cutscenes, and some of these cutscenes are really bad. You know, I'm hoping that we'll show some of the really, really bad ones, but, um, you know, in bad meaning just corny. Um, but anyway, so I, that's probably coming from that. How do I switch? Okay. Well, that, that was no good. How do you... Okay, run dives. All right. You can't see anything in that pixelated mess. Like, you can tell it's a referee because of the lines, but... <laughs> because of the stripes. I don't know how that's going to show up on uh, on that capture. Um, let's see. But anyway, had a lot of fun with it. So I remember a few of these players, just from their numbers. That's Kevin Green, obviously, 91. Um, and there definitely is a difference. Even if you can't find the stats and look them up in this, there's definitely a difference... Um, different players are, are faster or slower or some of them are easier to um, um, to tackle than others um, that kind of thing and actually I noticed toward the end of the game uh, the last game that I played TV Sports Football on here I noticed that um, uh, whenever I was doing the, the replay and I was going back over listening to the audio to make sure everything was fine and there wasn't any glitchy video or whatever um, that the players, the defenders were chasing my quarterback, I think it was a quarterback, anyway, on the long run I had, the defenders were chasing them at different speeds. So there are different stats for players in that previous game, at least speed, anyway. Um, um, which I was, I was surprised and I just didn't notice when I was actually going through and playing it. Um, interception. Now it seems like, I thought that the game when you like intercepted the ball, like the camera like shifted around and like changed. But either I'm thinking of, like, maybe the Super Nintendo version, or I'm thinking of, of maybe it was, like, in 95 they changed that. Because when you intercept it, it just changes real fast. You're going to start running the wrong direction. Like, that's just going to happen. Get out of my way. You know, this isn't... Well, that was okay. That was all right. What did I pick up? Maybe five or six? Three? Okay. <laughs> Half that? All right. All right, let's try and, let's try and actually throw the ball. Um, I think I should have Neil O'Donnell. Maybe I, I didn't. I hadn't paid any attention to the quarterback number here. Fourteen. Yeah, that's Neil O'Donnell. Um, and I don't think there's any way. Like I pulled up the options menu. That's what I have. Like I can watch a replay or I can call a timeout. So there's no going in and looking at your roster or any anything like that. Um, okay. So this is. There's no windows. Eighty nine. I think that's Ernie Mills. It's ridiculous. I still remember all that stuff. So this is this is after the windows because I think the passing windows were back in like ninety two and ninety three maybe something like that. Um, meaning I, I guess it released in nineteen ninety one and ninety two. Um, so let's see, let's see if we can throw it again. Pro form. Gosh, and there's so many more plays obviously in this in this one than there was in the uh, in TV sports uh, TV sports football. I think that, that might have gotten, I don't know if that got deflected. It came out looking pretty bad. Um, all right, let's, I love how the, the, you know, some of the guys just run off the field there because, you know, you've got to get the right personnel in. All right, let's see. Here. Oh, all right, cutting, cutting. All right, well, it's all right. Gosh, I, I, I remember there's a there's a couple games um, from my past um, that um, that were involved with this system that I cannot tell you how excited I was to to get. Um, one was for Christmas, which is this one. Wow, that he's really slow. Um, one was uh, this one for Christmas. Fourth and four. You know what? Let's try a field goal. I don't have much uh, faith here. But one was this one for, for Christmas. The other was Street Fighter II Championship Edition. <clears throat> and that one was for my birthday, I'm wanting to say. This is really going to be bad. Yep, that was that was horrid. Although, I, I think it's doable with a little bit more practice. But I was trying to get the, uh, the little meters thing to come up. And I actually hit the button several times before it did. And I, I think that may just be... An old controller um, situation there, but again, because I'm playing this on actual hardware. Okay, let's see here. One, three, 
this was one of the few games that was out on this system that when I got it, I, I felt like it's like, okay, you know what? I've actually got a got a legitimate, uh, well, not a legitimate system. I, you know, because I, I always felt like I had a legitimate system. But it was just cool to have a few games that everybody else did. Um, you know, looking back on it now, I absolutely adore the games that, uh, you know, that nobody else ever got a chance to play because, you know, at this point, that's what's driving the, the cost up on these on these games. Um, and so I, I'm just so thankful to have gotten the chance to, to play them. 78, was that Bray Seals? Yeah, this game is so... It's so dated, but it, at the same time, it's just so fun. Oh, they just call a timeout? I guess they did. Anyway, so I, I guess I'll stop it here. Um, well, I kind of hate to, though. <laughs> I kind of want to keep playing. But, uh, I keep picking 3-4. You know, I really... Well, that's okay. I don't remember some of these players. I, I want to say... 50 or 54, I think, was like... I want to say his name was Holmes, maybe? I'm afraid to... So, okay. I should have just done it. I was like, I'm afraid to select somebody else and try and knock it down. I'm just going to get do something wrong, but... Computer did something wrong. I wonder if you can dive and hit people after the play in this one. Um, I'm going to try that this next time. Because I remember on the, one of the Super Nintendo games you and I played, Derek, um, you could, like, mess with the other... Uh, with the other team, like, prior to the snap or after the snap or something like that. You could, like, go over there and, like, just start beating the crap out of them. Um, I don't seem to, you don't seem to be able to do that in the... Well, I just dove, but I missed him, I think. Well, there wasn't enough time. And the cutscenes may just kind of prevent that as well. Um, let's go to dime. I want prevent. Short zone, there we go. But uh, this was also the game, if I'm not mistaken. Now, well, the Super Nintendo, one of the Super Nintendo versions that we had the whole string cheese situation. We'd have a, we'd have, <laughs> gosh, I hadn't thought of that in a long time. But we'd have a good play, or, or you know, we'd sack the quarterback, or get a pick, or, or whatever, and we'd, um, that that would that would uh, we would reward ourselves with string cheese. <laughs> oh man, oh good times. Good times. All right, 52 seconds. I, I'm going to finish this this quarter out here. And you know, and I don't think this game looks that bad. At least not on the, the screen I'm playing. Again, I'm really hoping that the game capture does does it justice. It was as much as it can. But, uh, gosh, the whole string cheese thing. I, just, I had not thought of that in a long time. All right, let's see here. Read... Why I keep wanting to be this guy on the end? I don't six. I don't know who this would have been. No, I switched up there. I think I might have made the the play. I did see number twenty six. That would have been Rod Woodson, and I think I saw thirty nine, which would have been Darren Perry. Carnell Lake's probably there somewhere too. Goal line attack. We're going to attack left just because the more field over there. Well, I need a nose tackle. Okay, one throws your numbers up, or your arms up. Crap, there's a freaking touchdown. It throws your numbers up. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so two switches people, one put your put your hands. Oh, wow. <laughs> Some of these, these cutscenes are just, they're, they're almost meme-worthy. All right, let's see. So this video has gone on a bit long. It, it, let's see. What's the, what's the score here? Darren Perry, Rob Woodson. Anyway, let's see, Joel Steed's probably in this too. Ninety-eight. That might have been him. I don't remember. Okay. Anyway. It's good. Yeah, it's good. And I couldn't tell couldn't tell you anybody that was on Cleveland back then. I just there's no way. But anyway, I'm gonna stop it here, guys. Uh, I, I hope you've enjoyed. Um, I, I am gonna play another another football game uh, here at some point. Next video I, I upload, that's the plan. Um, so uh, 
But as always, like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, you guys take care. And, well, hey, he jumped. I don't know how I did that. But anyway, <laughs> you guys like, comment, or please like, comment, and subscribe. You guys take care, and uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll see you next time.